In the game Stringing Numbers, players in grade kindergarten through four work together to create a number that satisfies a goal on a cue card. To play this game, use a deck of playing cards. Remove the kings, jacks, and jokers. Use the Stringing Numbers cue cards for the grade levels of the players. Gather players into pairs. Give each pair of players six playing cards. Flip over the top cue card. Read the cue card aloud and place it in the center of the table. Players then work together to create a number sentence that fulfills the requirement on the cue card. Here, we can see players working together to create a number sentence that equals a multiple of 25. They find one solution and write out the number sentence that they find. The team earns a point for each card they used. Now, let's look at the natural flow of the game in this video. We see that first the players take some time to look at the cards they were given. Then, one player arranges the cards in a way that she believes works. Finally, another player asks, does that work? Players worked a little longer on the same task and found that they could use all of the cards. After the game has concluded, ask players questions like, what does it mean to be a factor of another number? Or, what does it mean to be a multiple of another number? Other good questions to ask players are, are multiples and factors related? How? What is a composite number? And what is a prime number? There are plenty of variations to this game. In stringing more numbers, each player is dealt two cards to combine to make a multi-digit number. For example, if you're dealt a 5 and a 7, you can use the numbers to make 57 or 75 to help reach the goal on the cue card. In this version, you earn points by being the team who gets closest to the required goal. For stringing numbers extended, more advanced players can use exponents, square roots, factorials, and other more advanced operations. Play using one, two, or three digit numbers. Playing stringing numbers is fun for players of all ages. It promotes teamwork while players have fun with math. Click on the instructions link on the Regional Math and Science Center website to read the game rules or just rewatch this video. Have fun playing!